This is my kitchen. Come on in. Let's get started. Today, I have a very special guest with me. My friend Cecile. Come on in. Hi, Mary Kay. How Hi, are you? Cecile. Thank you so much for asking me to come. Cecile and I have been friends for, oh, what? 20 some odd years. We were but mere children. Oh yes, <laughs> we, we met as babies. <laughs> okay, today Cecile, we're going to do one, probably one of your favorites. We're going to make a, an onion soup. Oh, my favorite. I know you love onions. Mm -hmm. Okay, we can get started. Okay, let's go. Let's heat up my pan. Okay. Again. Okay, what do, what do I have to do now? Uh, let's put some butter in the pan first. Okay, that's, that, that's, there you go. We, we know what the butter is. Can you hand me that knife and we'll stick that in there? There you go. Oh, it's starting to melt already. Good. So we'll melt the butter a little bit. Then we're going to put in all these onions. Oh, very good. Boy, can you smell them right now? Our butter is about melted. Let's get some of these onions in there. Sounds good to me. Okay. All right. This is teamwork. Careful we don't splatter. No, you don't splatter. Okay. There we go. Oops. Uh, we missed some. Oops. We're missing a lot. That's right. We'll get it. There we go. I think you got them all. That's good. Yeah. We're going to stir these onions. You can put that down now. Okay. Now, I don't usually use sugar, and you know that. Mm hmm. But to really brown the onions, it helps if we add a little sugar. Okay, that's this one. So, yeah, we've okay. got about, it's, and it's such a minuscule amount. There's only about three teaspoons of sugar in here, but it's going to make our onions darker. Now, you can do it with without the sugar mm -hmm. and maybe not brown your onions quite as much and that'll still be pretty too but we're gonna make this look real pretty okay so we're gonna cook these onions up how long oh this is gonna take a while this will probably about 15 20 minutes to get them brown we cook these onions oh what 15, 20 minutes. Something like that. Now, mm -hmm. if I hadn't used the white onions, they might have been a little darker. But oh, they may get darker. They're nice and soft. They work very well for what we're doing. They're just not real dark. It looks great. So what do we do next? Next, we are going to thicken this a little bit. We're going to add some flour. Okay, I think that's this one. Uh, yeah, looks okay, like flour. Okay, there you go. Yeah, it's flour. Okay. So we're going to add this. We're going to stir this in. Stir it in gradually so it doesn't all clump up. I hate clumpy gravy. Mm, so it looks good. It's thickening up. Doesn't really look like onions so much anymore. It still smells right. like it though. Yeah, it really has a nice aroma. So how long does that cook? Well, we're just going to, about a minute or so to get this in there and then we're going to add the broth. Okay. We're going to do that very slowly. Okay. Oh, is this the broth you made this morning? <laughs> I didn't have any homemade broth, so I cheated and bought, but I bought the Low Good fat, stuff. low sodium chicken stock, chicken okay. broth. So that's what we're using today. Okay. I, I wouldn't in this time. Okay. All right, let's start adding that very slowly. You pour okay. and I'll stir. All right, this is called teamwork. Put a little bit in there and we'll stir it. Mm. All right. Okay. Ready? Yep. Okay. Let's get some more there in there. Mm. All right. Hang on. Let me stir it some more. Okay. Yeah, it's getting really thick. Yeah. Ready? Yep. Okay. Are we going to use all of this? Yes. Okay. Okay. 
Ready? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, I think you're okay now. So how much do you have in here? I think it's about oh, about seven cups or uh -huh. so. Uh-huh. Okay. There's only the three of us for lunch today, so I thought that was more than enough. Oh, yes. Enough for seconds. Yes, definitely. That's great. All right. Now, how long does that cook now? Well, we're just we're going to get this smooth, and then we're going to add salt, pepper, and thyme. Okay. Which salt, pepper first? Yeah, we'll just throw a little bit of that in. Okay, shall I? Sure. Take the, the, the this... Oops, oh. and I just turn it upside down and just... And there we go. Okay, when? Oh, what? We both like lots of pepper. Yeah, okay, good say when. This not really good. There we go. That's good. Okay, and now a little bit of salt. Just a little bit, I don't like a lot of salt. I don't either. That's good, that's okay. more than enough salt. We just kind of... Put that in there just to taste. Okay. Now we're going to add our thyme. Okay. And that's this one. A little at a time. Yeah, just, yeah, slowly as I'm stirring. Okay. It's taking some nice color there. Mm-hmm. All right. Now. Now. Now what? is probably the most important ingredient. Which? Well, we could use either white wine or sherry. I don't drink sherry by the glass. However, I do drink white wine by the glass. So we're not using white wine? Oh, no, that would be a waste. Good. Let's Here. put some sherry in. Okay. Looks like white wine. Chardonnay, maybe, it looks like. Doesn't taste like it. Mm. There we go. Mm. Oh, it's smelling good. All right, now we're gonna turn this back down to low heat and we are going to partially cover it and let it simmer for, oh, 20 to 30 minutes. Okay. So. Cover it. There we go. Now, we'll be back. While our soup is simmering, Let's get our croutons ready. Sounds good. We'll brush each side with mm. olive oil. I'm getting it all over my fingers. But you know, olive oil is very good for the skin. It's also good, very good for the bread. Yeah. <laughs> and then you put these under the broiler. We're gonna put these under the broiler. For how long? So they're just golden on the one side. Then we're gonna turn them over and we're gonna add cheese. Good. Um, so what are you going to put the soup in? I mean the, the onion soup. What are you going to, where are you going to put it? We are going to serve it in bread bowls today. Oh, how neat. Okay. Can I help? You want to get the oven door and I'll okay. slip it in? Okay. Put them right under the broiler. Okay. There it goes. There. Now, we'll watch those. Wait until they're toasty on the one side, flip them over, put cheese on them, and hopefully by then our soup will be ready. Wonderful. We're back. Our soup has been simmering, and we're ready to serve it. Sounds good to me. Mm. It smells so good. Mm. Can I help out? I'll... Okay. Well, let's... Gotta make sure we get some of this onion in there. Mm -hmm. Looks great. Oh, there he goes. Is that enough in there or more? Oh, we'll put a little more in there. Mm -hmm. Okay. Next. We'll do one up for Carl too. Okay. We'll let him join us for lunch today. Oh, that one's mine. It's got the most oh. onions in it. Well, we've got to have a little bit of broth in it. There we go. Not too much. Okay. Now. We remember okay. we uh, cooked the croutons mm -hmm. while we were simmering our soup, so let's take croutons ah. and float them right on top. 
More than one? Oh, there we go. Or more? Okay. All right. Mmm, mm, those look good. Now those have the cheese on them. Yes. Mm hmm Yeah, we toasted one side and then we turned them over and put the cheese on. Oh, those look great. Mm. And then we'll garnish that with a little parsley and we're ready to eat. That's good to me. Carl, you want to join us?